Hey guys, this is Chef Pranav, and I hope you all are safe home. So, guys, today I'm going to do I'm 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 going to do a risotto. I'm going to do it from start. A lot of you were asking if I can show you how to cook a risotto from the, the start. So, I'm going to do that today, and also I'm going to flavor it with the red pepper sauce that I did the last time. So, that's that's going to be my sauce for my risotto, and then I'm going to add a bit of ingredients here and there, and just make it you know more. palatable and delicious so let's go so what i will have in today is i've got my arborio rice which are raw so you just keep it like that and start off with onions in some olive oil and butter and then i've got i'm going to deglaze it with wine but today i do not have wine so what i did was i used brine of olive capers and yeah so i used brine today and uh, that's pretty much it and i've got i've got some butter out here some almond Flakes to garnish with some basil to finish off parmesan, and out here I've got my salt, pepper, my vegetable stock, and this is red pepper which I've roasted and I've julienned it. I've got some sun-dried tomatoes, some olives and capers which I'm gonna add in my risotto, and then this is the red pepper sauce I did the last time. Very tasty and very delicious. So I'm gonna add on this towards the end as well. So let's go. Start off with I'm gonna heat some olive oil in my pan. and a bit of butter as well and i'm going to saute my some thyme and onions so once they are almost translucent which are there so i'm going to add my arborio rice straight away so about 2 cups of arborio Here. Once they're sauteed, I'm gonna deglaze it with wine, about a cup. And start adding my stock, little by little. Uh, so guys, now my rice is cooked till an al dente stage, uh, which means it has a bite to it. Now I'm gonna throw in my peppers, my olive capers, and my sun-dried tomatoes. My sauce. So good. Risotto to be. It shouldn't be very thick. It shouldn't be very thin, like a soup. Now at this stage, I'm gonna switch off my heat and put in my butter, Parmesan cheese. That's an essential, and my basil leaves. 